Who what when where why how? Who what when where why how? I am reunited once again with Alexis Fight. The one and only. No. <laughs> <laughs> it is going down in Philadelphia, my hometown. How does it feel to be in Philadelphia right now? Man, I keep telling everybody I'm excited to be in Philly. I love Philly cheesesteaks. I love Philly. I love the people. I love the atmosphere. It feels close to home because I'm from Buffalo, New York. So Okay. You know. How is it how how is it how How's Buffalo, New York treating you? Like, it's cool. I don't live there anymore. I've been gone for about two years. I relocated to Kansas City, but love Buffalo, New York. It's cold, but it's a cool place. Okay, okay. Any um, newcoming projects that you're doing right now? Well, my album, LOL, Living Out Loud, is still out and doing really well. Uh, it was number one on Gospel Billboards last year, and um, it was nominated for two Stellar Awards this year. So God is blessing it. I'm excited about it. Um, I just put out my third single, Live Right Now, and God is blessing that at radio as well. So I'm just excited, man. Okay, okay. Tell me your, your inspiration behind your music, because I just got into your music mm -hmm. when I reunited, well, when I first saw you and whatnot. So who's your inspiration? Man, it's so many. God is definitely my inspiration. Um, he just brought me through so much. I know what it means to overcome adversity at an early age. You know, I've been through a lot, um, but God has always been faithful. Um, even just to be here, you know, it's proof that God is faithful. And so I'm grateful. I've been pursuing this for a long time, but um, God is blessing me, and I'm grateful for that. Um, so he inspires me. My family definitely inspires me. They support me. They're strong. They're motivating. Um, and so I'm grateful for that as well. And um, I just, I got a lot of inspirations, but those two, I would say, are the most inspiring my family and God okay okay I see you I see you doing your thing I check you out on you know Instagram and Twitter and Facebook I'm like okay and one thing I like about you is that you still talk about God and you, and you sing about it you have this great anointing but you still reach out to the youth and I appreciate that we got to man we Be got to stick together you know because I love like the Clark sisters and stuff yeah. like that but we're not in the same, right. you know, age range, so right. I can't really relate right. to, like, you know, all the struggles in the marriage and all that. Definitely. And just kind of relate to, you know, your struggles and what you're going through. And Absolutely. I appreciate that. Man, to God be the glory, man. I know in this day and age, our young people are dying. They're dying physically. They're dying on the streets. They're dying mentally. You know, there's young people committing suicide and battling suicidal thoughts and going through stages of depression. But, you know, I just want people to see me. And when they see this red hair and when they see me praise God like I do, I want them to know that you can overcome, you know, those obstacles. You can overcome adversity. Um, and, and you can be who you are and be bold for Jesus. So I'm excited about it. And um, I can't wait to see what else God has in store for the journey. I can't wait either, man. So, on the half of uh, Sectum Magazine and Doc and Lisa, me and everybody on the team, we want to officially uh, give you this magazine. Y'all always try to make me cry, but I'm not going to cry because I cried in the, give me this mic, I cried in the last interview and I'm not crying in this one. Okay. So Thank you. <laughs> so here you go. Thank you it's so your official much. magazine. Thank you for inspiring all the you and everybody's. Me personally, it's the Sector Magazine over and out. Sorry about the.